The Envision campaign has already raised over $50 million from people, corporations, and foundations. They hope to reach $100 million. Mayor Allen Joyne says he's excited it's happening here in his city. The things that are going to come from this, I believe, will further solidify and tie down Winston-Salem's tie-in to Atrium and Advocate Health going forward. The funds will focus on cancer research, cardiovascular disease, and neuroscience, regenerative medicine, and more. When we are treating patients, we're treating patients with the therapies of today. But we all know that these therapies are not ideal. For us, it's the next generation of treatments that are going to mean the most, not just for our patients here in our own institution, but regionally and throughout the world. And 800 donors from 47 states across the country have already pitched in. Dr. Atal says helping raise funds can take away from scientists' research time. The average time that a scientist spends writing grants is about 50 percent. 50 percent of their time is spent writing grants. Imagine how many more discoveries from the brightest minds that you see out there that you come from all over. PhDs, scientists have trained for years to do the research and you're basically restricting their work by 50 percent. Wake Forest officials say the campaign will take place over the next two years, and anyone who wants to donate can do so on their website. Reporting from Winston-Salem, Phil Sterling, ABC 45 News, standing up for you.